Well, a bad week for some Valley daycare centers busted for unsanitary conditions. Yeah, but the problems aren't just limited to the kitchen. Tonight, shocking finds elsewhere. Get ready for the good, the bad, and the dirty dining as we reveal what's not on the menu in this week's Food for Thought. Learning Village Daycare Center on 334 Morningside Road in Brownsville is the dirtiest this week on Food for Thought. 30 demerits, it's a low performer. Not on the menu, expired baby oatmeal by more than a month, missing soap and towels for proper sanitation. High chairs and changing tables are dirty as seen in these inspector photos. The daycare also gets popped for a number of safety concerns, including electrical cords exposed, kids unattended, kids running in and out of the kitchen, and this disturbing note that reads a six-year-old is not allowed to be bottle feeding an infant. Management refuses to open the door for an interview. So the Food Patrol question staff directly linked to the violations through a window they crack open. There was a six-year-old feeding an infant. Why? But he's his, his brother. But why is it? Why is he feeding the infant? You, isn't that your job? No. That's not your job. It's my job, pero el baby, el niño, el otro niño agarró. But what did the health department tell you? You're not allowed to do that, right? No. How yes. long has that been going on for? I don't know. I don't remember. Bright Kids Daycare Center on 925 East Stanger in San Benito is busted with mice poop. Look on the report. Droppings on the sink, counter, and shelves in the kitchen. Workers shield their faces and refuse to comment on efforts to clean up the mess. Mercado Superstore and Meat Market on 7425 East Monte Cristo Road near Edinburgh isn't keeping it clean. Roaches are what's not on the menu. Flies, too. Other violations include no soap or towels for proper sanitation in the restrooms and at the sink in the meat market. This week's featured top performer with zero demerits on a health inspection report is El Sombrero Cafe on 210 West Jackson Street in Harlingen. No words, no words. Is this happy? Martin Rodriguez is talking about the restaurant's new top performer sticker. Open for breakfast and lunch, the server tips his hat off to this for the success. We just have a good team, that's all we have. Yeah. Yeah, we have a good team, uh, teamwork. You know we say to that. Keep it clean. Well, congratulations to these additional uh, top performer sticker winners. Churches in San Juan, Peter Piper Pizza, Taco Deluxe in Alamo, El Pato in Mission, Rudy's in Far, China Restaurant, Hime Sushi, and Chuck E. Cheese in Harlingen. Congratulations. Remember, kitchens, keep it clean. We're reporting what's not on the menu. Are you a Food Patrol insider? It's real easy to get the inside scoop on dirty dining before news hits the air. Just follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I'm online right now. Just search Ryan. Wolf 